Anonymous contacts usually represent a major part of any website's contact database. Using experience, you can easily personalize the content of any page, and you can show a compelling lead magnet to any anonymous contact, a magnet that makes them submit a form, register or subscribe to a newsletter. Let's look at how you can group all your anonymous contacts, which will help you smoothen their customer experience and improve your marketing data. In experience, go to the Contact Groups application. Select a new contact group and fill in the group's name and code name. Add a precise description of which contacts are part of this group and share any important details. You can add condition rules to define which contacts experience adds to this group. First, let's add only contacts who gave us permission. Select the correct consent to make sure you'll not be breaking any privacy laws when you start personalizing the content of your website. Add the second condition that checks if a contact has already provided their email address or other personal information through an online form. Change the parameter to has not. In the Select Activities drop-down menu, select Form Submission. When you save your changes, you'll see the overview of the group. If a new visitor matches the group's conditions, experience puts them into this group. The same applies to existing contacts who perform any activity on your website or if someone updates their profile. Experience adds them to the group if the updated data makes them eligible. However, existing inactive contacts do not become group members automatically. So if you don't want to wait until contacts update themselves, use the recalculate button. Experience adds to the group all contacts that fulfill the group's conditions. Let's test it on the KBank website. Open the site in an anonymous window and accept the privacy policy. Let's browse some pages here, but don't submit any forms. We can now get back to our anonymous contacts group. As you can see, the contact is already here. And you can check the contact's details, including their consent and the pages they visited. This way, you can collect your anonymous visitors in a group. Thanks for watching.